Kevin Connolly is having a really good year. The actor started off 2009 with a Golden Globe nomination. Then he appeared in the blockbuster film He's Just Not He's just not that into you. And this, uh, this week's sixth season premiere of his hit HBO show, Entourage, scored its highest rating in a couple of years. And Kevin Conley is back. Well, you know what's great? Pick up the paper. Entourage is coming back. And the reviews have been really, really good. So they, everybody's talking about the show. It feels like it's been reborn. Yeah, no, it's, uh, it's been great. And, and also in this, being the sixth year of the show, the fact that we're, we're doing the numbers that we're doing and people are still, are still into it is great. It's a good sign. Do so. you know when you're doing the show, uh, season after season after season, this year did you say, well, you know, this feels different. It has a little different feel to it. Well, Doug Allen, uh, our, our creator, I think he knew he had to kind of sort of reinvent the show but keep it, keep it the same uh, mm -hmm. at, at its core. So, uh, yeah, I mean, we knew we were doing something a little different. We were a little nervous, but people seemed to have responded the yeah. right way. So. For people who pay attention to the show, there's a whole thing going on. You can tell already <laughs> Sunday night with you and Sloan. Uh, yes. The, are the embers, is somebody the, the flame, are they fanning the embers to flames? He's trying, he's, trying, he's chasing down the, uh, the old girlfriend, trying to, trying to get back with her. So. Right. That's sort of what I'll be uh, working on this season. Yeah, there you go. And, of course, the, the, the star of the, of the show right. is, is getting his legs back underneath. Exactly. It's, uh, you know, last year was kind of, a, you know, a, kind of a rough year for the guys. I mean, it ended, it ended well, but mm -hmm. uh, this year it's back to uh, everybody's, everybody's doing well. It's good times, uh, right. nice cars, good Re parties. Recessions over. Exactly. exactly. <laughs> okay. <laughs> let's, take a, let's take a look at a clip. I didn't want you to come here tonight as my friend. I miss you. Eric, don't. I know I screwed up. I was a sh boyfriend. You used me as storage. I mean, you moved in for a week and then left. No, look, I know that was all my fault, but things are different now. I finally moved into a place, a place that you found for me. Eric, you moved in this morning. I can't just jump back in. I don't know if I can be just friends with you. So this is about, is it's high school's over. Yeah. These guys are maturing and you have finally looked in the mirror and said, it's time. It's I gotta time. make a commitment. Exactly. All right. I've moved into my house. Yeah. And now I'm trying to. Now I gotta get. Now I gotta get the girl. So All that's right. that's what I'm doing. Oh, geez. The, the, I'm, I'm, it's very interesting to watch, and it's very interesting to watch this thing evolve. What is it like working at? You've been in the business kind yes. of forever. <laughs> yeah. Does this mirror at all anything that you know about Hollywood? I mean, I would say, you know, to a point, you know, uh, again, it's a TV show. And, you know, it's always glossed up a little bit for, for TV. But, yeah, I would say uh, the show is very insightful, right. I think, more than anything, as to sort of how the ins and outs of the business and how it works. And, and as you travel around Hollywood and, and people see you, what do they say? They must, everybody must have an idea for the show. Oh yeah, everybody's got a everybody's got a, got a pitch, uh, and it usually is some, uh, something that benefits them or whatever oh, it is. That they want to get their shoes great on. Idea they that, uh, get... I got a great idea. Johnny Drama goes tanning. I said, you know, it would be even a better idea if we shot it at your tanning salon. What do you think of that? You know, <laughs> well, so, it's never that's sort of, of what that's sort of what. Uh, there you what, go. What the idea is. Long Island Kid. How old were you when you first started working? Six years old. Six yeah. years old. What was your first gig? Uh, I think my first gig was like a Tender Vittles cat food commercial or something. 1980. It was a long time ago. Tender so. Vittles. Yeah. Yeah. Is that even still around? <laughs> I'm not sure. But Who even really knows? And did you, when, you, when you come back here, do you go home? Oh, yeah. I spend, uh, you know, my family's on Long Island, so I spend, uh, spend most of my time out there. Actually. And, and how is your reception when you go home? It's it's great, you know. Um, I still have the same you know crew of guys that I that I grew up with. And, yeah, still. Uh, yeah, yeah, still. You have you still have your own entourage. Uh, well, yeah, <laughs> it's terrible, but yeah, I've, actually, <laughs> sort of so. And I hang out at the same places actually. So. Yeah, very cool, Kevin Conley. It is always a pleasure to Thanks see you. Thanks for having me. All right, we're gonna keep our fingers crossed this morning for you know who knows what happens. <laughs>